Martin Reeder here and Reed Hall, the Athlete Matrix. We're in the Vert Lab. We're stage four. Vertical education, we've gone through one eccentric force, two single jump, and three multi-directional. Those first three are critical, okay? You have to have earned the right to do number four. This is where all the magic happens. This is applying special forces to the body. We're essentially tricking the body through science to make gains. Read. How are we gonna do this? Okay, so I wanna talk about, so if you're moving a weight from point A to point B, you're jumping, you activate the appropriate amount of muscle fibers to do the action. So you're jumping, you might use 60 to 70% of the muscle fibers. But if you add an external load that could be weight or put yourself at a mechanical disadvantage, you're teaching your body to activate more muscle fibers. And when you can bring in more muscle fibers, you jump, you're ultimately gonna have more power and that's what allows you to jump higher. So this is called neurological system. The connection between our brain and initiating muscles to fire fast is what's gonna be going down right now. So we're gonna hop over here. We've got a few exercises for you. Stay tuned, get pumped up. It's game time, baby, let's do this. So stage four, neurological jumping, we're gonna do some bounding, some repetitive bounding. So we're leaping, landing quickly, and leaping. Reed's gonna hook us up with a really nice example of the bipedal one. Amazing. So you're gonna notice that Reed is landing softly and jumping as quickly as he can, full body, using his arms really fast, really tight. And let's move to single leg here, Reed. Unreal. So this is an amazing way to develop speed. Think 100% activity. You are going as hard as you possibly can. That's step one. Okay, so this is maybe my favorite exercise. This is dumbbell squat jumps. So now we're adding some load to the movement. We're gonna jump as high as we can and land. So I'm only gonna do three jumps. When I land, I absorb the impact, they explode up massively. So I wanna be aware, knees aren't collapsed again. Good mechanics, hips are back, explode. One more time. Load, jump, jump, jump. And it's all power, baby. So you're probably thinking, more is better. Oh, I need to grab a hold of 80, 100 pound dumbbells so I can jump the highest. Incorrect. This is about smaller tricks, so smaller weights. Think 15, 20, 25 pounds, 25 pounds being on the heavy side. Lighter is better, really quick, we got a third one here. So this one's unbelievable. So we're gonna connect dumbbell squat jumps and hurdle jumps. This is literally the trickery route we're talking about. So when I do the dumbbell squat jumps, I'm activating, I'm initiating more muscle fibers, I'm getting faster contraction speed. Now when I jump the dumbbells, your body thinks it still needs to use all those muscle fibers, and we feel light, and we jump extra high. Check it out. something to look forward to being able to do. We're going to do a quick recap of all four of our steps in the vertical education program. Stay tuned.